Anders FC TV tager lige nu en snak med vores tjenest træner Colin Todd. Colin, a super performance against OB, a lot of ignition. What did you see? Um, I think, you know, I saw a performance that was full of energy, full of uh, ability. The first half was very, very good in terms of our uh, desire to, to take the, uh, the game to the opposition. I thought we created created a lot of chances, you know, and um, put them on the back foot. And I think the progress uh, has been good. We have to continue trying to make progress. That's all I keep saying. It's all history now. We start again on, on Friday. Um, we have a couple of suspensions. And it's amazing when we do get suspensions, it's not one, it's two. But it could be worse, it could, it could have been three. Yeah. But yeah. As, as, a, as a coach, you have to deal with that. Yeah. And That's people come in and people come in and they have to uh, play to the best of their ability as well. Yeah. It's their chance. To yeah. Their chance. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. But this is so f- first fantastic. What about you? Don't you tell yourself, is this real sometimes? Because no, I mean, I've, I've, I've been there before and... Um, What's I think I'm, I'm no, I'm very, I'm very level-headed um, because I know there's, there can always be pitfalls, you know, and we have to safeguard ourselves, and that's why it's important that the the players obviously take the credit. I want to say take the credit. Uh, they enjoy, um, you know, the the fact that we're winning games, but we we have to keep our feet firmly on on the ground uh, and make sure that our ap- application, our desire. Our commitment uh, is is 100 yeah, percent. Yeah. What kind of a game do you think it's going to be against uh, OB Friday? And are there some things we can learn from the first match against them? Uh, um, I think we're best not talking about the first game yeah. that we played against them. Yeah. You know, we didn't um, do ourselves justice. But we have an opportunity at home to hopefully um, do ourselves justice and and continue with the ability to to play an attacking game. Um, but I think, you know, as as a group of players, we have to make sure that uh, we, we don't uh, give uh, what I would say uh, needless goals away. Yeah. I think goals that can be prevented, uh, we have to work probably harder at. I mean, I'll, I'll always be the first to hold up my hand and say. You know, the, the opposition have deserved that goal, but sometimes they don't deserve it. Uh, and I think that aggression defensively, you know, has to be probably uh, harnessed uh, more. Sober. Then let's make a party Friday. It, it, it's not so much a party. I think it, it's getting the maximum out of them players for 90 minutes. And when I say players, I mean I mean, I mean the squad. You know, because we uh, we made changes on on Monday. Oliver came in, um, and Char- Charlie came in. Then Boring came in and produced a good goal. You know, so they have to be ready as well. You know, and but take that opportunity. when the two-two, you put in three uh, players, offensive players. Yeah, I, I, I just felt, felt that um, you know why, why not uh, put try to put them on the back foot again. Yeah. Um, I think it was the right decisions to to do, not to to say that Camper or Fisher were playing badly, right. but I think it just needed uh, yeah. a little, a uh, bit more uh, surge in, in the way that we played, yeah. um, and I think that that tells you that we we do go and try to win games of football. So. A lot of a lot, a lot of uh, managers or coaches might have put a defensive player on, but we went the other way and um, put two attackers on, three attackers on. Yeah. Thanks. Well, it could have been worse because if it happened, we conceded one. People would have been saying, yeah. "What a crap!" Oh, Colin. Oh, yeah. <laughs>